My name is Phil Herzig, and I'm a fish biologist here with the Fish and Wildlife Service in Sunderland, Massachusetts. Norton Dam in Colchester, Connecticut, historically was a, a mill dam, and it went through several um, types of mill, and it hasn't been used um, since the 60s. It is in total disrepair, as well as the mill house is in disrepair and they've had fires and it's also failed the dam safety inspection. The flock process dam in Norwalk, Connecticut is on the Norwalk River and the most important part is to remove that dam for migrating fish, a sea trout, alewife, and blueback herring. The Nature Conservancy is, the, is our grantee. As a guess, I would expect between six and ten for each site of uh, construction and landscaping positions that would be utilized in the whole process of removal. Not to mention the permitting as well as engineers. We have engineers that are designing the removals and so those are all positions as well. Fish and aquatic passage is a long-term benefit for fish and wildlife. Fish could um, be migrating depending on the on the season or time of year they could be migrating through the what was the dam which is now uh, the river they could be migrating immediately within a day or two i also think that that's part of the community's benefit as well restoring our rivers and streams to their uh, natural state is in our best interest as humans and it also will help provide resiliency for flooding a year later when you go back there'll be uh, shrubs and things growing on the riverbanks again hopefully and and you'll you hopefully won't see the remains of a of a dam there